Hi, Juan. How are you, Allison? So good to be back. Welcome to the Roosevelt. I can't wait to see what you've all done. Well, you know what? We got a little time, so let's come and show you. Okay. We just went through a huge renovation in 2021, brought it back to 1935. Tell me about the history of the Hollywood Roosevelt. We're celebrating a 95th anniversary this year. We opened our doors on May 15th, 1927, with the idea of actually hosting Celebration of Hollywood. On May 16th, 1929, we host that very first celebration, the birth of the Academy Awards here at the Roosevelt. <laughs> now let's talk about this gorgeous historic lobby. We called on the gentleman who had actually painted the ceiling here at the Roosevelt in 1927. He had passed away, but his son did his father's work. So he said, I will come in, complete the work, and restore it back to the original splendor. The original chandelier that you see in the middle of the historic mm. lobby, we restored it back to the original look. Tell me some of the Hollywood legends that have stayed at the Hollywood Roosevelt over the years. From Clark Gable and Carol Lombard, to probably the most iconic guest that we've had, Marilyn Monroe, to Reese Witherspoon and Renee Zellweger staying here in the lucky sweet 1010 that we call. If you win an Oscar, that's where you're staying. So speaking of the Oscars, show me the Blossom Room where the very first Oscars were held. Absolutely, no okay. visit to the Roosevelt's complete unless you visit Blossom Ballroom. So let's go take a look at it, come on. Welcome to the beautiful Blossom Ballroom. Here at the Hollywood Roosevelt. Beautiful. Isn't she stunning? Beautiful. It was home to the very first Academy Award. Oh my God, I can just feel the vibes of the very first Oscars in here. Can you believe that? Oh my God. May 16th, 1929, we host the very first Academy Awards in this beautiful ballroom. Well, this is, must have been like one of the table setups, like, right? It was. So what kind of events happened in the Blossom Room? She's still doing two of the largest film festivals here in Los Angeles. Turner Classic Movie Festival, of course, and AFI. And this room probably just transforms into whatever you need it to be. You can just imagine. This is the Clark Gable Carol Lombard penthouse. It's called that because this was their love nest back in the 30s. It was also home to Prince in 2007 when he had sold out shows here at the Roosevelt and the Blossom Ballroom. And then recently it was featured in A Star is Born with Lady Gaga and Bradley Cooper. Allison, this is the rooftop of the penthouse where our very famous Roosevelt sign lives. Yes. Best views I mean, of all of town. You have Century City downtown, and of course the Hollywood Hills. I mean, the Hollywood sign. Tons of events. <laughs> you can't even get better than Hollywood than that. These right here are the Shirley Temple oh, Stairs. Oh, gosh. Now, they're called the Shirley Temple Stairs because she would come over here and practice for hours on by, and then also in our historic lobby, oh, we have our huge. letter box. The drop goes from every floor wow. upstairs oh my God. to the historic lobby. So literally the 12 floors above us drop into this letter box and it still gets picked up every day by the post office. Imagine all the postcards that were in here back in the day. And no tour is complete at the Roosevelt until you get to see the Tropicana pool. Ooh, let's go take a look at it. Go. Oh, gorgeous. This pool that you see right here is not just any pool. Right. It was hand painted by the great David Hockney in 1988. Can you believe that? No. It's valued at a million and a half dollars. I've seen pictures when there was no water in it and he's just drawing it up and he's restoring it. Absolutely. How exciting. And Marilyn Monroe. Well, in this very spot right here used to be a diving board. Right. And this is where Marilyn takes her very first photo shoot. Now, these are two of my favorite drinks here at the Roosevelt. Thank you so much. Cheers to the Hollywood Roosevelt. Thank you for coming and joining us.